Morning everyone, welcome to day five of the wonderful Mediterranean cruise on the fantastic Avia. Uh, please like and subscribe and hit the little bell button to get the next video. I'm Erica Caroline and we'll see you soon. Thank you for watching. We're at the Zenith uh, restaurant for breakfast again today. Um, so I've gone on a really healthy route which is just a bit of porridge and some honey that I give you and fruit salad, obviously with a tea and apple juice. So um, yeah, the porridge looks quite nice. I'll just put some honey on. So where are you going first thing today then? Yes, yeah, so today I have got the um, my nails uh, to be done. Yeah, I've got traditional uh, manicure and pedicure today. So I look forward to having that after breakfast. Um, and then I'm not sure what we're going to do after that. We'll probably talk around the ship, maybe. Because it's day five, isn't it? And yes. it's another sea day. Another sea day today. Yeah. We've, we've booked for Sindhu for this evening. Um, that's, that's all, really, isn't it? It is so far. Well, there is a show on, isn't there? There's part two of the privateers. Oh, yes, part two of the privateers. We may see them again. We may not. We're not, we're not sure. <laughs> yeah, see how, it, see how it goes. See what else is on. Yeah. And I've got the... Uh, granola again, which was nice yesterday. So, yeah. okay. okay, okay. See you soon. Bye. So it's Erica's birthday tomorrow, so I'm just going to go and order her some flowers. I think I have to go to reception uh, to do this. And normally they have uh, several options available, and you just tick the box, uh, put your room number in, and say when you want the flowers delivered. Uh, and then they should set them up nicely in the room for me. Um, probably tomorrow, I guess. I think they normally want sort of 24 hours notice, but uh, yeah, that should do nicely. Good afternoon. So we are, we've had a nice walk around Deck 8. You can go all the way around the ship on Deck 8. So we had a nice walk around there. It's lovely weather outside. Uh, and uh, we've just come in for uh, our coffee um, and a few biggies. <laughs> and uh, just having a rest and uh, planning the rest of the um, afternoon, really. We'll have lunch in a bit, um, and uh, yeah, good. We're thinking about what the next holiday may or may not be, aren't yes. we? Yes, yeah, so we're half talking about that, aren't we? We're going to do next year yeah. a holiday, so yeah. <laughs> Enjoying it so far though, aren't we? And yes, it has warmed up a bit more today, hasn't it? It is, yes. It's much warmer with a slight, slight gentle breeze. So uh, the captain just said it was 23 degrees, um, slightly overcast, and um, with a seven knots of wind. Okay. So it'd be perfect, basically. <laughs> Most people are out on deck sunning themselves, aren't they? Absolutely, yes. So uh, it's not really for us. We, we worry about getting too burnt. So not really sunbathers, are we? No. I always want to with those. Um, Announcements like that. I always want to hear the little bing bang bong like know, Heidi High yeah. before it. <laughs> well, before it did go bing, didn't oh, it? did it? Oh, it they, they should bring that back. They should. Hello, um... <laughs> Hello campers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was good. Yeah. Oh well, so we'll so, finish yeah. our coffee and um, yeah. report back soon. Yes. Bye. Hello, guys. So we just had our lunch. We just had our usual uh, cheese and crackers. And uh, on, on the, just after our lunch, we thought we'd find out about the retreat, uh, which you have to go to the spa area to book uh, any uh, day passes if you wish to. You do have to book early. They do uh, go quickly, uh, but it's £59 per person uh, and it's 8 till 8. So 8 a.m. till 8 p.m. is a day pass. So, yeah, so that was interesting. I thought I'd let you know about that. Uh, and earlier I had my uh, hands and feet done. What do you think? <laughs> and my feet, yes. <laughs> that was also £59 uh, for traditional uh, manicure and pedicure. So that was really quite nice. Uh, and uh, yes, yeah, so we're just on deck eight at the moment uh, where you can walk around the ship. So uh, see you soon. Bye. Been having a relaxing afternoon and I went to the gym, didn't I, yes. for an hour? Yes. And feel a bit better for doing that actually and uh, you listened to your audio book and, yes. and stayed, were you, was that on the balcony? Or yeah, what? I was on, on, out on the balcony uh, listening to my audio book, uh, really getting into it, so uh, yeah. <laughs> and then been 
And then we've been watching a man called Otto. Yes. It's, uh, oh, what's his name, the actor? Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks. We love Tom Hanks. So uh, got into that, haven't we? Yeah, I've been watching, um, well, three quarters of the way through that. And now it's one of the highlights of the holiday, for me anyway. Yeah, more for you. <laughs> Going to the Sindhu for a nice Indian meal uh, this evening. So we'll record the courses and, yeah, yeah, see what that's like. Yes. Did you want to see me in my Indian dress? Oh, yes. On about yes. them, my Let Indian dress. The and we go for Indian. I don't know why. It's just a... Oh, it's that style, isn't it? I suppose it's the tradition. Uh, I have it. The... I guess. I don't know what it is. But, uh, yeah, we all. I always wear this dress when, uh, when we go to... Um, Indian it, restaurant. Yeah, so. See you soon. See you soon. Bye. Okay, so we're in Sindhu and we've just received the menus, haven't we? Yes. So, oh, there is a little thing that says ordering tips. We offer a range of dishes to suit all tastes. See our guide below to help you choose. So this is my stew that I've got here, it looks really really nice, which is the pork belly stew. Um, I'll give it a little try. It's lovely, very, very cooked really nicely, um, nice and flavorful, not very spicy at all, um, but lots of flavours. Um, but not spicy, so it's actually really nice and the pork's cooked really to perfection. And is that just a normal roll or what is that? Um, oh, it's like, yeah, I think it's just a, a bread roll. So you dip okay. it in the bread roll. Okay. And you, Danny, what have you got? I've got some of well, these lamb cutlets, so... Okay, let's see. Oh, okay. Let's cut that there. So it's obviously crispy on the outside. It's so basically like a sort of breaded lamb, but with all the spices. Really good. So the starters were really lovely, weren't they? Yes, yeah, I really enjoyed mine, although it was quite a lot for a start. It was quite a big portion for a starter, it wasn't was. it? It was. I could have done with half the roll. Um, but uh, yeah, it was very, very nice. I'd probably give that an 8 out of 10. I did thoroughly enjoy it. Mine was about the right size, and yeah, I did really enjoy it, so yeah, I'll give that like an eight and a half out of ten. Yeah, so. Um, no problem, yeah. and we're just debating, because it's Erica's birthday tomorrow, where we want to go, and the Prime Minister burger's come up in conversation, yeah, hasn't I, it? I love the Prime Minister burger, but I think we might go in the Green and Co again. We were so impressed with the Green and Co, um, and we might sort of maybe have the same name as we did last time, but different starters. The, uh, Way to say there's like three main starters that everyone popular. has to try. Um, so you apparently you can have them as a starter, like a shared starter. Um, so we might do that. Um, so everyone drank today. And I very rarely have got a Cobra beer. Yeah, he's got a beer. Yeah. Oh my god. So just to get recap, um, this is um, just the rice to share. A vegetable one to share, and that's uh, curry lentils. Lentils. And of course, the and bread. And um, bread. A big close up of the duck. Wow. The duck, yeah, with the uh, tikka sauce. Tikka sauce. Did you want to give it a little yep. little test drive there? Let's, um, let's see how they've done the duck. Looks really nice. Yeah. Should be a little bit pink inside. Yeah, it's quite pink. Yeah, yum. Yeah. And then I'll try the tikka sauce. We've got some nice chilli oil there, which is, I like uh, to yeah, more warm you. things up a bit. Mm -hmm. Good? Yes, the duck's cooked properly, although I've got a little bit pinker, but um, it's not tough or anything. The tikka sauce isn't too spicy, it's nice. Yeah. Nice sounds. Yeah, I, I think I think obviously they try and make it suitable for more people, don't they? <laughs> so it's probably sort of, yeah, not as hot no, as maybe your local no, Indian restaurant might be. Mild. Well, um, uh, but, very, they, very mild. but yeah, they do some fantastic flavours, don't they? Mm -hmm. Yes. So, um, Lovely. We'll dig in. Yes. Yum. It's easy. So yes, that was lovely. I thoroughly enjoyed the duck. Um, it was uh, very um, aromatic. I would give it 9 out of 10. The only difference would be slightly pink the duck and then it would have been a 10. Definitely a 9. 
and uh, the duck was very lean, wasn't it? Yes, it was. It lean. wasn't fatty at all. Let's see what, uh, see what yes. the dessert menu's like. Yes. So, what have you got there, Erica? So, I've got the pancake cheese. Uh, sorry, pancake. Um, it's ice cream by the looks of it. An ice cream, and it's banana. Ooh. So they like banana pancakes, aren't they? Is that the idea? So. Go on then, give it a try. <laughs> oh yeah, it looks a bit. Yeah, it looks yeah. different. Yeah, it's um, yeah, made from banana. Oh, lovely. Mm. Just any other ice cream. And what, what are the it? yellow things there? Mango. Oh yeah, they did say mango, didn't they? No, it's not mango. Some sort of sorbet? No, it's quite crunchy. Oh. Um, Sweet but tangy. I don't know. Okay. Like, uh, citrusy. Nice. Anyway, what have you got there? Yeah. So this is the yogurt, the yogurt cheesecake, and ooh, just, you just look at like that. We're just gonna shake on. Yeah. What do you think? Really good. Yeah. yeah. Base isn't as crunchy as I was expecting. It's like a soft base, but the, the yogurt part of the cheesecake is really yummy. <laughs> Busy day. Yes, yeah. Very busy day today. We had breakfast at the, uh, the Zenith. Zenith. Was it Zenith again? Yeah, was it? Was, yeah. Okay. The Zenith restaurant had quite a nice healthy breakfast actually. I felt like doing yeah. a healthy breakfast. So that was nice. Because it was a sea day today. Yes. So I think we just had a walk around, didn't we? And had a look at sort of. Yeah, that's true. Went we just had the ship. a Go and get my nails so done. So we had breakfast, Eric had her nails done. So let's have a look. Yep, yeah, so there we are. <laughs> and I also have my toes done as well. Oh, that's um, so that's nice. Yeah, yeah they, she did very nice. That was £59 for a traditional manicure and pedicure. So uh, quite good value, I think. And then we'd had a light lunch. Uh, we played cards around the Sky Dome as well, yes, didn't we? Yes, and of course, a kids' movie. They were playing Wallace and Gromit movie, which I love that movie. So, uh, but we got the tail end of it, but. Uh, we shared a lemonade, didn't we? Yeah, got some and, uh, from the bar, some, yeah. yeah. from the bar and played cards for a while. And then I think we did another walk again, actually, around Yeah, it was the starting ship. to get a bit hot by then, wasn't yes, it? Yes, yes. Oh, we found out about the retreat, uh, as I said earlier. Um, you can do a day pass, but you must book early. You have to go to the spa on that one, which we didn't know. Uh, yeah. And it was about £60 each a day. Or £59 yeah. each a day. So. And we did find out, we did get some prices for some other cruises for next year. For next year. And we found out that there's 5,200 people on board this cruise. Yep. Plus 1,700 crew and staff. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, so quite, yeah, I knew it was a full, a full ship full to ship. this uh, yes. holiday. Mm -hmm. A lot of queuing. It's not been too it's bad. It's not been too bad though, although that sounds like a huge number. Uh, we've been able to find seats when we want to. Yeah. We've got into the dining when yeah. we wanted to. And we're able to go in all the lifts when we want to. We've been able to get to the theatre shows at the time. Times we, we wanted, wanted to. to. So really it hasn't been much of a too compromise. Really. No, no, just a bit yeah. of queuing, but not too bad. Pro probably if you're if you like the buffet a lot, yes. that's probably the one place you would notice. Yes. But yeah, there's yes, a lot of people. Yes, yes. Uh, but we've been going to the breakfast in the restaurant. Yes. Rather than previously, we always would have done the buffet. That's all. Right? And then uh, lunchtime, we have a later lunch. So the crowds start to die down after that um, oh. a little bit. Yeah, sort of like from about, I know, one thirty, two o'clock ish, three o'clock ish. They still do lunch. It's just uh, not so many crowds and you're more likely to get a Well, seat. and also we're only picking up cheese and crackers, which yeah, is easy. If you were it. trying to put together a oh, full, full complicated lunch, you'd have to I don't know, of... they still had quite a lot there. If you wanted like a roast dinner or something else, they did have a lot there. Oh, I don't mean the choice. I just mean that there's a lot of people. It would take you longer. 
Yes, it would. Because all you've got to do is get a single plate, cheese and crackers, and then we yeah. both share. Don't, yeah, don't that's we? true, yes. Whereas if we were both like having more of a full meal. Yes. Um, oh, I see what you mean, yes. It would just be yes. a, bit, well, a bit more time consuming and probably a little bit more frustrating. Yes. With the amount yeah. of people there. And then we... Well, I blew all that hard work from the uh, <laughs> exercises by Sindhu. Yay! Yay! So, yes, I've got my <laughs> Sindhu dress on. Uh, yeah, we had lovely, lovely three-course dinner. And we have sorted out what we're doing tomorrow. So we're looking, yes. very much looking forward to tomorrow. Yes, it's my That's birthday what? tomorrow. Yeah, 21 again. 21 again. Medieval castle trip we're going to. And um, what country was it? So this is what, Spain. Must be. No, I mean, like what? Oh, After what Spain. place? Uh, Valencia. That's it, Valencia tomorrow. Valencia tomorrow at this um, lovely looking castle. Uh, but yeah, but so we've yeah. got a medieval castle and then and the then Limelight like Club up. at seven o'clock uh, with, uh, I'm sure, a great entertainer there. Yes. So we'll, probably what we'll do, I think we're due to get back from the uh, tour on land by about two o'clock. Clockish, like yeah. That. So we'll probably have, have a, a little rest. A little nap or rest or something yeah. before the dinner because obviously it's quite a long dinner because you've got a dinner and a show mm. and also you've got the band as well that plays in the beginning as well don't they yeah they tend to so, sort of warm up don't warm they up, they have the yes. band playing or or maybe like the house band or yes, something just yeah. do a couple of songs a couple of sets yeah and then uh, the main artist comes in yes and so does, does their set, set uh, yeah so uh, so we'll we'll yeah, it's something to look forward to. No, normally finishes half nine, ten o'clock, doesn't it? Something like that. So yeah, yeah it is really, and then, really, uh, really. And then this evening we. Um, oh, the privateers. Yes. Part two. Part two. Yes. Enjoyed their second show a bit more, I think, because I knew more what to expect. Mm. I think, um, let's say, sea shanties weren't my immediate sort of. No, but they are good. Like. Yeah, but very talented yes. guys. Very talented. Yes. They really play the instruments really well, don't they? Really well. Really good on guitar. Really good on violin. Yeah. Or fiddle. Yeah. It is. Um, <laughs> they made a few jokes to 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 that. Yeah. Uh, so yes, do go see them if you do ever go. They're all over on different ships at different places. So. Uh, yeah, do go see them if they're on board your ship that mm. you go. Yeah, yeah, no, they're um, really good. They are really good. They're quite funny as well. They've got a bit of joking yes. sort of banter on there. Yeah, entertaining. <laughs> good beyond banter. Just the music. Yeah. But, uh, so and we'll see who we get on. Yeah, and then then we went. That. Yeah, then we went on to the uh, crow's nest, of course. Oh yeah. And I, I just had a quick cocktail, which was the apple and elderflower. Uh, spritz again is quite refreshing and light and very sweet um, and I really enjoyed it last last night so I had another one again but it was quite noisy and, and busy so I, we just quickly had a drink. Uh, yeah and, we did uh, try and do back. our summing up of the day filming up there yeah. so they do a bit of a loud cough, cough and, uh, yeah. didn't want you to keep, keep. Have to listen to that. No. <laughs> so um, we, uh, we wrapped Decided that up didn't we yeah. and uh, thought we'd finish here and then we'll get home camera all charged up and ready for the ready tour for tomorrow because I like the sound of medieval castle there is quite a long walk just to let you know okay 800 meters on an incline oh god and then there's another walk actually when you get into the castle oh god so uh, yeah oh, I hope it's not Sensible too hot to yeah well I was sneakers and, anyway uh, yeah be yeah. ready oh god take some water with you well yeah we're going to take water and bars with us but yeah. um yeah, because they don't provide any food. I don't know how we're going to survive. There isn't any food for a few hours. <laughs> I mean, that's not happy cruising. No, well, what's going on there, guys? Come on. <laughs> uh, there you go. We'll be all the more set up for the, um, the food at the time. Yeah. We? Oh, we'll be on our knees by then. Yeah, uh, we will be knackered tomorrow. Yeah, we will be tired. Yeah, so it might be a quick end of the day. Yeah, and lovely time. See you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. Um, so, yeah, so till, uh, till then, see you tomorrow. Till tomorrow, see you tomorrow. Bye. Good evening everyone. Thank you for watching. I hope you're enjoying our vlogs. I'm Erica Caroline. Please like and subscribe and don't forget to hit that bell icon to get notified of the next video. I'll see you in the next one.